as you can see i haven't even used it tried it once or twice it was just no bueno for me no bueno para me baby no bueno para me um so much hype when it came out I hope you guys are doing wonderful and as you guys saw on the thumbnails we're gonna talk today about eyebrow one-on-one -on -one, okay these are only my opinions it's only what I've observed it may or may not apply to you so I'm gonna give you my opinions on all of the eyebrow products that I've tested whether it is the micro brows pencils or the, the ones in the pot so I'm gonna talk to you guys about what I've enjoyed and what I haven't enjoyed and I'll give you my opinion as usual on my channel it's all about quantity and quality at an affordable price we never promote consumerism but we we'll give you advice and the tools that you need and the sales discounts and promotions that you need to be able to acquire those things should you be ready and we we'll test them out for you with we'll absolute genuine love okay so without further ado let's get started i will talk to you about the first part of the the, the set i have two videos so it's a two-part video so please do watch both this is part one and part two will be coming up so you ready so let go i have all right guys so i have a couple of them here okay first one we have is the maybelline brow precise micro crayon but i think this was like dark brown or something when i found the name of it i'll insert it on screen but guys i could not even i finished using this but this was one of the worst products that i've ever tried in my life so if you were looking to try this particular product by maybelline it is awful and that is the maybelline master brow precise crayon or pencil I actually think I didn't finish it up. I think it kept breaking. Okay, that was the thing. I wasn't able to use it because it just kept cracking on me. And eventually, everything cracked and I just tossed it. So, so yeah. So, the Maybelline Brow Precise Micro Pencil is a no-go for me. Again, I'll insert the shade on screen. I did not like this Micro Brow Pencil at all. Okay? So, the next brow pencil is the LA Girl Shady Slim Brow Pencil. And I have the color Brunette. And I also have the color medium brown. Now, listen closely. I hated these two on me, just on me. But guess what? I kept watching videos and all my favorite influencers kept saying, try the color black brown. And the color black brown, baby, is amazing. But these two particular colors, for me, did not work. I tried them so hard. That's the packaging for the Shady Slim brow pencil right there nothing unusual and i did finish them guys they're creamy in consistency so it's easy to apply it's just a little bit hard because it doesn't have any waxiness just, just be careful that's the spoolie brunette and medium brown no bueno but the black brown baby the black brown is amazing so do try that one but these two no thank you next we have the wet and wild ultimate brow retractable brow pencil in the color dark brown and that's just the packaging love the aesthetic easy to clean doesn't get messy that is the spoolie right here okay um i actually didn't finish this i didn't like the consistency of this product and i feel like i don't know i didn't like the formula so i didn't actually use it up but it is good a lot of people i know have liked it and you have a fat spoolie and since this one still has some product let's swatch it for you guys real quick so you guys can see it's very waxy it's so waxy and not creamy i think that's the reason why i didn't like it but the color match is amazing i think it was just the fact that it was so waxy and then the shape was a little bit hard for me to use but i can make it work if i wanted to but i think it was just so waxy so i couldn't use it but I, it's not my favorite it's not bad i usually love wet and, wet and wild products it's just that it's too waxy for me so it takes too much time for everyday makeup and i feel like i have so many other the ones that i will be showing you guys in the upcoming video that you will prefer so it's good you can buy it with sales promotion coupons it's amazing i mean all of these you guys know i got them at cvs with sales coupons discounts and rewards so they were pretty much very affordable even though they're already cheap um so yeah so that's my take on the wet and wild pencil i didn't like that that much so yeah 
all right so this is the elf ultra precise brow pencil and i hate it so much as you can see i haven't even used it tried it once or twice it was just no bueno for me no bueno para me baby no bueno para me um so much hype when it came out i didn't like it again i only make purchases on the elf website when they have 50 percent off or i buy everything at cvs with sales and promotions and discounts and rewards i hated this one so much i also mentioned that with elf it's always a hit or miss you either love it or you hate it um there's no in between and also the packaging is never great it's rare to see great packaging with elf products so elf please upgrade that um they may look pretty but they may not be functional so they eventually they will break so this one is i think i don't know so this is the elf one it's so so waxy and so so hard to use i cannot i can't be bothered the color is amazing as you can see but the waxiness and ah oh, it was just not easy for me to use and it breaks on me a little bit so i just was like you know what i'm not gonna bother it's too waxy and not for me it's not easy it's not on the go it requires a lot of work which i don't need because i have other ones that i love again it can be good for someone else but for me i need a medium of waxiness and a little bit of creaminess I, and I cannot have the product break on me as I'm trying to draw my brows. Other than that, the color is amazing. It could work for you. Just give it a try. It's up to you. But for me, I would not repurchase it. So yeah. And last but not least, we have the Milani Easy Brow Automatic Pencil in the color dark brown. Again, you guys know Milani products are amazing. I get them at CVS if I have if I can find the product there because I use all the sales that are available. Again, the packaging here is gorge. Here is the end of the pencil and that is the fat spoolie. It's the most creamy um, product that I've ever used. And again, I finished it up, but it was too creamy. So this, you cannot outline your brows with it. It's almost like a gel, you like a cream. So you can fill in your brows with it, but even that, I feel like it's too creamy. But yeah, it's too it's too messy. I, I couldn't do it. Nothing wrong with it. It's just, if you like that creamy, creamy, creamy factor, you might enjoy this. And again, I finished it up, but I'm going to try to color my hand. As you can see, that is the brown. It's a very, very dark brown extremely creamy i think that's why i didn't like it it's hard to draw with this you have to be very very used to doing makeup or brows to be able to get it to function the way you want i think with this you will go in with a micro brow pencil first to line if you really wanted to use this and then fill in your brows with this it's just way too creamy too creamy so yeah not bad but just way too creamy especially for beginners or on the go so there you go with that it's not one that i will purchase again but that's my opinion <laughs> all right guys thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed the video i hope i gave you guys my input on the brow pencils that i didn't like for this year 2019 i will be having a, a, a part two of this video coming up shortly so please do stay tuned that one will be a little bit longer because i have more products there but again that's it if you have any other recommendations or suggestions for me please comment down below or please check out my blog and contact me there or my social media platforms and we can chat more yeah thank you so much and i'll see you guys next time and don't forget to always praise god Mwah. ciao guys bye Put you to the test, just do your best And let God do the rest, an enemy's stress I'm a living witness, I'm the proof Nothing is impossible and that's the truth You can't achieve if you plan to If I can make it, man, you can